Hello everyone, welcome to another episode of J Bros Cooking. And today we are going to be making two different things. We're gonna be making banana bread French toast. That's right, banana bread French toast. And then we're gonna be making banana Q. Now this is something that I've had in the Philippines many times. I'm gonna to attempt to make it. All right, let me put my glasses away, my old man glasses. So first I'm just gonna take some cooking oil. I think this is just regular vegetable oil, not olive oil or anything special. Just some vegetable oil. I just put it on my flame right here. And I'm just gonna go ahead and dump it right in here. Then I'm just gonna take these bananas. Now a lot of times in the Philippines, you'll find these like on a stick. So delicious. And in the Philippines, the bananas are a little bit smaller. It's a different type of banana. All right, so I'm just gonna take these bananas. Does that look pretty? All right, so now that my oil has been warming up, I'm gonna go ahead and add my brown sugar to it. So we're just gonna stir this up till it kind of gets like a caramelly consistency. So then I'm just gonna take my bananas and go ahead and put them in. Ooh, yummy. We're just gonna stir it around so they kind of get coated. All right, so now I'm just gonna make my standard French toast mixture, which is pretty much universal. Maybe not. I used to work with a guy who used to make French toast all the time, but it wasn't uh, sweet, it was like a savory. It's pretty good. Let me go ahead and start with my milk. Just pour it into this bowl. Boom. And then I'm gonna take my eggs, which literally are golden these days. Crack one open in here. Crack another one open. Hmm. All right, and then I got some sugar. Go ahead and add my sugar in to the mixture. Vanilla and some cinnamon. And then of course my eggs. I don't know if I mentioned this, but I made banana bread before. Actually, my wife made banana bread. I don't really bake, you know, it's not my thing. Could I make banana bread? Absolutely. Could I make it better than my wife? Absolutely not. So here's this delicious banana bread that my wife made. John's message, I mean, John's, John's telling me what to do too. Thank you, John. I'm not sure I understand. All right, so I'm just gonna throw some butter into this pan. All right, going in, just wanna dip this real quick and kinda get it coated. Got this piece of uh, banana bread that I just dipped. Throw that in there, oh, yummy. All right, so we're gonna give them a quick flip here. We made banana bread, French toast. John, I've got to take it back here so you can see it, but look at that, mmm, dude. The banana bread made into French toast with the banana cue, we sliced them up, so delicious. Just gonna go in right here, get a piece of banana, get some whipped cream, get the toast. Gonna to come back around here so John can see. You see that, Johnson? Look at that, John, oh man. Mmm. So go ahead and give us your opinion, Johnson, real quick, before you have to go. Uh, I definitely eat that. Uh, what you do to the bananas? That's called banana Q. It's like a street food in the Philippines where they glaze it with sugar and oil. It's like you can buy it on the street. Usually it's a whole banana. You can buy it on a stick, and it's uh, kind of like a street food in the Philippines. It's delicious. It's amazing. But I sliced them up, put them on top, because I'm such like a chef, you know? Yeah, that definitely looks good. I think there's something very, very good. This is John coming to you. He's back in the hospital. We just wanted to bring him in real quick so he could uh, check it out. And I'm sure he'd have some pointers. What would you do different, John? Uh, you know, I haven't watched the video yet, so I can't tell you. Well, wait for his comment in the video. So uh, I'm sure he'll tweak something on it, which, you know, rightfully so. So here you have it. We have banana bread French toast with a uh, banana Q. Oh, it's it looks so good. So delicious. And this is a Filipino street food. I didn't make it exactly, but my wife said it's, it's acceptable. It's not perfect, but it is acceptable. Appreciate it if you give us a like and a subscribe. You can follow us on all of our social media at our website, jbrooscooking.com. You can find all of our recipes, merch, and 
Like we always say, yo. It's always better when you make it yourself. Hey, bros. Yeah.